Oh, chips. Can you smell them? <sighs> Hello, welcome to the Yorkshire Dad, today's vlog. Uh, it's already about quarter past seven at night, so this is going to be a quick hello. Not a lot happened today, goodbye. Um, we just had our tea, uh, or if you posh, called dinner. Um, we have dinner at lunchtime, because lunch, I don't know what that is. We have it on a Sunday, Yorkshire puddings and that. Um, just out in the garage, just fed the dogs. Uh, I'm trying to debate what to do with the old skateboard that we've got lying around. Um, it's a bit battered and bruised, I'll just show you. It's uh, it was it was a second hand jobby, um, or a car boot sale I think for a quid, but um, it, it, I just feel like I'm letting it just decay, um, and I'm sure it's uh, I'm sure it can be cleaned up, done up, so I think I'll have a go. And we've got a skate park in Kirby, um, so maybe it could be a vlog a vlog challenge to go and try and kill myself at the skate park on a skateboard. Um, I have never skateboarded in my life. I think Lydia bought this from the car boot sale. Never skateboarded in my life. Um, it's something I've always fancied being good at. Um, and to get good at something you've got to practice. I, that, that's what I preach. So to practice what I preach, if I want to be able to skateboard, I'm going to have to practice. So I might give it a go. I might not. A bit like the roller boots I've got. Roller boots? <laughs> How old am I? Roller blades. I've got some roller blades. They're a tad too small for me. Um, I'm not too bad on roller blades. I might, uh, I might vlog that one day, the rollerblade challenge at the skate park. Um, yeah, so, um, tea, what did we do for tea? Oh yeah, I had a tuna pasta bake. Um, cheap and cheerful meal, plenty of pasta, chopped tomatoes, uh, tin tomatoes, passata, frozen onions, peppers and mushrooms, two tins of tuna, cheap as chips, girls enjoyed it. Yeah, maybe on garlic bread, yeah, it was super. I, I like meals like that. One pot of cooking is my way forward. Uh, right, so uh, I'm going to crack on now. I might have a go at dismantling the skateboard and uh, seeing what what to do with it. Um, but apart from that, I've got not, not a lot going on. Oh yeah, I might walk the dogs. Might walk the dogs. We'll walk the dogs. Um, that will uh, that'll be nice in the rain. So, uh, yeah, I'll uh, be back later. Watch this space. Washing some puddles, and we found a puddle. Right there. We found conkers. And conkers. Giant horse chestnut tree. Only two conkers on the floor, and I can't see any more in the tree. Very strange. Look at that splashy puddles. I'm in my wellies too. I can go in puddles. Splish splash. Oh my goodness me, that was deep. <laughs> splish splash. Splish splash, splish splash, splish splash. Let's go find some more puddles then. That was a big one, wasn't it? Yeah. So only Delilah and Verity wanted to come out to walk the dogs, but they don't get a choice because they can't stay home. <laughs> Hello. Um, but so you see, Lydia and Grace's uh, mission to not spend time with parents at the moment is a phase they're going through, I'm sure. See, so he's going to backfire because... Uh, oh, come off the road, guys. It's going to backfire because we're going to call at the chip shop and see Mummy and get some chips. And they're not going to get in it. Am I a bad daddy? I don't know. I'll have to see. That was a big splash. Big splashes. Another one. Big splash. Wow. Oh, Verity's going to have a go. Go on then. Whoa! Yeah, so we're going to call up the lemon tree for some uh, chips. Oh, if you're ever in Kirby Moorside, please do get some chips from our oh, fish and chips from the lemon tree because it's a really nice fish and chip shop. Right, let's crack on with this walk. Duke's been very pulley tonight. He's just on one at the moment. Adolescence. Right, crack on. Fresh air and grass. And trees. trees. Just fresh air, grass and trees. No, it's not a public footpath, we're not allowed. It's a farmer's field, darling. 
They bought it with money. Well, I'm really disappointed. Well, I'm really disappointed because North Yorkshire Highways have been and put loose chippings down on one of the roads we come on. And now there's no puddles. So there's no puddle splashing going on down this road where there is usually some puddles. That's really not on. Really not on, is it, girls? No. All freshly chipped. Field behind us. It looks like it was on fire recently. It smells yeah. like burnt. Oh, I'm going to clean that up. It smells like burnt grass, and yeah, if you can see, it's all charred. I don't know when that happened. I ran, I ran down here the other day, and it wasn't like this, so it's this week. It does smell, doesn't it? Yeah. There it is, there's a puddle. Go splash in the puddle. Yay, well, big splashes. I got tangled up with the dogs. Just passing on here, there's something called a slurry lagoon. I'm not sure what a slurry lagoon is. Every time I pass it, I wonder. I really need to look it up one of these days. Having fun, finally found a puddle up. There it is. So they're happy, they've had another splash. Nearly off the lane now, and head for the chip shop. Chip shop. What did you just say? Nearly at the lemon tree chip shop now, so we're going to go get some chips. I'm not too sure Helen would appreciate being filmed while she's working, so I'm not going to film in there. So it's just around this corner. And we're going to get some chippies. Delilah's carrying them. Yay! And now we are on our way home to uh, eat the chips. I think a conker's just come flying past me. We're not going to get that, guys. It's rolled under that car. So we're just marching home now. Just getting dark to get some chips. This is the sad part of uh, British summer because uh, it's not even nine o'clock yet and it's starting to get dark. Yep. And you suddenly realise autumn and uh, the darker nights is just around the corner, which is a shame. So, on our way home to go and eat some chips, I will share the chips with you. I can smell the deliciousness. I can smell the deliciousness. Oh, chips. Can you smell them? Those tear smell even better when I've got this vinegar on. Lovely, jubbly, jubbly. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. There really is nothing quite like the smell of salt and vinegar and freshly cooked chips from the chip shop. Smells delicious. And with that, I'm going to leave you from today's vlog. Thank you for watching. If you would really like to see more chips, click subscribe. If not, don't. But hey, it would be really nice if you did, because I've got a lot to share. And like it. Brilliant. Thanks.